Have you ever wondered why some people seem to effortlessly achieve their financial goals while you struggle? It might be because they visualize their goals. Setting financial goals is a critical step towards achieving financial freedom. It's like setting the GPS for your financial journey, but just like a journey, it's not enough to know where you're going. You need to see it, to feel it. That's where visualization comes in. When we visualize our financial goals, they become more tangible, more real. Our minds are powerful tools, and when we can see our success, we are more likely to work towards it. Studies have shown that the psychological impact of visualizing success can increase motivation, confidence, and even performance. It's like giving your mind a taste of what's to come, and trust me, once it gets a taste, it hungers for more. So, how do we start visualizing our financial goals? It's quite simple. We create a financial vision board. The first step to creating your financial vision board is to clearly define your financial goals. Now, you might be wondering, why is this important? Well, without a clear destination in mind, it's easy to lose your way. It's like embarking on a journey without a map or GPS. So, whether you're aiming to save for a dream home, pay off lingering debts, or establish a robust emergency fund, it's crucial to set clear, specific, and measurable financial goals. Think of these goals as your financial targets, the milestones that will guide you towards your ultimate vision. Here's a tip. Make your goals smart, specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound. And don't just keep them in your head. Write them down. Seeing them in black and white can make them seem more tangible and achievable. With your goals clearly defined, you are ready for the next step. The second step is to gather images that represent your financial goals. Think about what symbolizes each of your objectives. It's time to get creative. If one of your goals is to buy a new house, you might choose a picture of your dream home. Perhaps it's a charming cottage in the countryside or a contemporary flat in the city. If you're aiming to be debt-free, you could use an image of a zero-balance notification or a certificate of debt freedom. For those of you saving for a rainy day, a picture of a full piggy bank could be a perfect representation. Remember, these images should not only represent your goals, but also resonate with you on a personal level. They should inspire and motivate you to keep pushing towards your financial objectives. With your images in hand, you're ready to create your vision board. The final step is to assemble your financial vision board. It's time to bring your dreams to life. You can use a physical board and cut out pictures or a digital platform with saved images, whichever works best for you. The key is to arrange these images in a way that speaks to your aspirations. You might want to cluster your goals into categories, short-term, medium-term, long-term, or you could arrange them according to importance or urgency. Now, where to place this board is crucial. It should be somewhere you'll see it every day. On your fridge, next to your computer, or as your phone's wallpaper. The idea is to keep your financial goals front and center, a daily reminder of what you're striving for. Viewing this board regularly can serve as a constant reminder of your financial goals. It's not just a collection of images, but a visualization of your future success. And there you have it, your own financial vision board, a powerful tool to help you achieve your financial goals. To recap the key points we've discussed today, the journey to financial success begins with setting clear and realistic financial goals. It's not just about numbers, but about understanding what you want your financial future to look like. We then moved on to the first step in creating a financial vision board, which is defining your financial goals. Whether it's buying a house, starting a business, or planning for retirement, it's essential to know what you're working towards. Next. We talked about gathering images that represent these goals. These visuals serve as a constant reminder of what you're striving for, making your goals feel more tangible and attainable. Lastly, we covered the importance of assembling the board in a way that resonates with you. This isn't just a project. It's a reflection of your financial journey. Remember, a financial vision board isn't just a collection of images. It's a tool to help you visualize and achieve your financial goals. So get started on yours today and take the first step towards financial success.